Hey my friends, what's going on? Cater here on a beautiful, beautiful day, my friends. So pound that for watching this video, pal. So in this video, guys, we'll be talking about um, Shopify drop shipping, you know, shipping problem. Like a lot of my students that's hit me up and say, Cater, you know, what's the how do I go over shipping problem with with you know customer having to wait for so long for their product? How do I deal with it? What do I do? So in this video, guys, if you're dealing with customers, you know, you, they bought an item from you and then they bling in your phone. If you actually have a phone line on your store, they bling in your phone every single day or they're sending you a message in your inbox. Where's my product? Where's my product? Why is it taking so long to the point that you've been canceling? So they ended up getting a refund. And now imagine if you drop shipping, if your um, if your provider already shipped out the product and now this person can so they get the money back whether it's through PayPal and now this product is still going to them. It's like by faith only they will send you the product back now you're at a real loss. So I, I know a lot of crazy nightmare like this where people they drop shipping the products and because of shipping down they ended up losing a lot more. So not only they have to pay Facebook for the ads they have to pay for the product and now they really lose their profit because if the person ended up you know, canceling, get their money from PayPal, they get a refund, they still get the product because they drop shipping and now they lose on their profit. So nobody's really losing except for them. So Facebook get their money, right? Shopify is getting paid every month because they pay for the platform every month. And the drop shipper, the person you actually get the retailer, the person you're actually buying the product from, they got their money. And the person who purchased the product still got a free product. So now there's four people who got what they wanted and you at a loss. You're the only one who does not get the profit. So how do you solve this problem? The shipping problem has been so annoying for so many people. If you can't relate, leave a comment down below if you do drop shipping. Now, here's a couple of different strategic you can go about it. And if you enjoyed this video but haven't subscribed, press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. For those of you that's doing AliExpress, a lot of you think that AliExpress only show only show um, China's product, but you can. There's an option in AliExpress. I have a couple of students. I was actually looking at a product they were sourcing, and funny thing, there was people in the U.S. that they can ship it for like five to seven days or less on Ali. But yet, they was only choosing people, vendors from China. So there's an option in AliExpress. Might just pull it up. All here. right, so we're in AliExpress here. So for example, I'm gonna show you something here real quick. I have a few students who came to me. So when you go to AliExpress and you're looking for product or you find this product, you're gonna order. So let's let's take one example of product that many people make money of and promote it. Okay, the app simulator, for example. So people would come here. What they do is come here and look for the product. Okay, we have it here. Um, this is the order. It's six ninety nine. So before you start looking at the price, six ninety nine, eight dollars, six nineteen. You click on it and then start ordering your stuff. What you want to do is to look at the options. Okay, where it says ship from on the far left, right on the top. Click on United States. So when you do that, because here's what happens already. There's a bunch of people in china and some of them have warehouses over here they already have contract with some people over here if a product is hot many people already have it they send it over here so although you might see that the processing time might be a little bit longer like five days just like the other just like it was drop shipping you can build a relationship with those people and your processing time will be a lot faster because you already know they already know what to expect from you they know how much you you're getting let's see another example of another product that was doing a lot that we were selling a lot on our store is the h30 drone the h36 drones okay for example those product before you go in and start just getting the product what you want to do is to click on ship from united states okay this is the h36 see i can find it over here in the states although there you go right here yeah i can find it over here in the states 21 dollars you know we were selling a lot of those so that's what i'm saying before you jump into you know just draft shipping directly from china you know there's people on aliexpress that can drop ship from the u.s Hopefully that makes sense to you. If it does make sense, let me know. All right, look on AliExpress, you'll see the option where you can actually click and get items from the US, from vendors in the US. That's one way you can help with that. Now, let's say you can't find this item at all in the US, right? On AliExpress, jump on eBay, do a little bit of research, jump on eBay, look for the same item. More likely there's factories, there's other people in the US who probably already ordered it in bulk. Imagine if it's selling a lot, 
you're not the only one who's paying attention to those items. So there's people who already maybe ordered it in bulk and they still have it in the US at a lower price than you're actually selling it on your Shopify store. Then you can, you know, send a message to those people, you know, create some type of contract and see where you can get them to make more sales on their product. Not only are you buying from them, you're sending them more sales. So maybe you can just buy from them and they can send you an invoice at the end of the week. That's one way you can solve that problem when it comes to shipping time, all right? The last resource that I wanna give you to solve the problem of shipping time, what you could do, if there's a product that you see that's hot, that you can actually sell it, what you could do is to buy a little bit of it, you know, buy like 100 units or you know, 50 units. So if you're gonna test this product, buy 50 units and get it to be sent to your house get that 50 units to be sent to your house and then you can send out the product a lot faster or if you do have any US warehouse you know you could do it like you do Amazon FBA fulfilled by Amazon you know go into your neighborhood or wherever in your neighborhood that has a fulfillment center right if you don't know anybody that has a fulfillment center I have a couple of boys that I know they have a huge fulfillment center I can hook you up you have to be doing at least a hundred orders a day I they, they do, they work major deals. Like if you already have a product, you want to scale it up to the next level, you know, you can send me a message in the back of my YouTube. I can hook you up with the details to those guys. But um, those are only resources that I provide to my student, but you have to be winning at a higher level. But what you could do, like I said, you can order 50 to 100 of that product yourself, keep it. Let's say you spend four to five hundred dollars on that product, so you're not really losing as much as if you was to go and then you sold like a thousand product at thirty dollars. That's thirty thousand dollars that you sold, and you spent a good fifteen thousand dollars in Facebook ads, and your profit was going to be ten thousand dollars. You ship out all these products. A lot of the people were saying they're not getting the product; it's taking too long. They're getting a refund, and now. And now it's killing your business. So at that point, really what you really want to do if you get in, if you can get that many order is to order it in bulk, get it to your house, ship it out yourself. If it's a lot of work for you, you can source it. You can source it to a, a fulfillment center where they can fulfill each item for you. They're more likely gonna charge you a price. Some of them will charge you anywhere between one to three dollars to just ship it out. So if you saving, if they charging you a dollar fifty cents. You know, so you can charge shipping price three dollars, and then now not only you you cutting on the shipping price, you're making money off of it. So fifty percent is going to you. So let's say you you charge a customer three dollars for shipping, and the fulfillment center over here is charging one one dollar and fifty cents for everyone they're sending out. So not only you charging the customer one dollar and fifty cents, and you're not shipping it out, the fulfillment center is doing that, but you're charging them three dollars. So that's an extra a dollar and fifty cents that you put in, in your pocket for every sales that you make. You know, you might say hey, it's not a lot of money, but it accumulates. When you have a thousand sales at a dollar and fifty cents, that's one thousand five hundred dollars you add to your pocket just on the shipping price. So understand that those are three ways, guys, that you can actually take care of the shipping problems. A lot of people have been telling me, yo, dude, like the shipping stuff is killing me. People are returning the product, you know, not returning the product, people are canceling their orders and they still get in their money. And sometimes the product is already on their way, they're just too impatient to wait for it. And now they still get the product, they keep the product, there's like nothing I can do. You know, and I'm the one at a loss. How can you fix that? So, guys, I give you three ways inside of this video. Hopefully, this stuff help you. You know, get um, buy in bulk. Um, you can either buy in bulk to yourself. Um, look for product in the U.S. using eBay. Um, sometimes check Amazon also to see if you can find it. Also, AliExpress. There's an option in there you can find U.S. vendors. All right. Number three is to get use of fulfillment center. And if you more want more information about my boy's fulfillment center. You know, send me a message in. Uh, leave a comment under this video. I, I'll send you a message in the back of the of um of my YouTube. But anyway, guys, we're gonna keep this short and sweet. Hopefully, that solved the problem for you. That was your boy Cater. Appreciate you. Let's take it to a whole next level, baby. I'll see you guys on the next one. See you guys later. Bye. Ciao.